Hey guys, what's up? In this video tutorial, I will guide you how to install Linux server in your virtual machine manager. You can see here, I have a Linux server and I have configured virtual machine manager in my Linux server. Open terminal and type here the command word hyphen manager to open the virtual machine manager. Okay, hit enter, type here the root password of your server. You can see here virtual machine manager is open. I have installed too many server in this uh, virtual machine manager. Click here to create a new virtual machine for installation of Linux server. I will be guide in this video and demonstrate how to install RHEL 7 in this virtual machine. Type here the server name. Okay, RHEL 7 choose how would you like to install operating system local install media iso or cd rom or network installed i have choose local install media go to forward locate your install media where is your install media cd rom or dvd or iso image i have iso image so select use iso image browse click here browse browse local and you can see here i have the RHEL ISO image select here the ISO image open click open and OS type select here Linux version is Red Hat Enterprise 7 click forward to go to proceed choose memory and CPU setting here you can set your memory size RAM ok I am selecting here the 4 GB of RAM ok 4 GB memory CPU size is CPU is 2 select here 2 for this virtual machine ok go forward and select create a disk image on the computer select here the disk capacity of for Linux installation I am selecting here the 15 GB capacity of disk you can use as per your requirement forward to proceed ok now create a new virtual machine setting is completed click here the finish now virtual machine is creating ok RHEL 7 virtual machine created or uh, now hit enter to go to proceed to installation of RHEL 7 Okay friends, installation is starting. It is checking escape to continue for installation. Now installation is started. Okay friends, select uh, continue to proceed. Now installation summary is showing select here the date and time and your decision i am from india so i am selecting here the india asia kolkata ok done select here keyboard english done now select language support here english too many language here you can select as per your language then done after that installation source i have already I selected the installation source ISO done software selection here you can select here the software selection base environment I have required for server with GUI you can select with your requirements I am selecting with server with GUI FTP server backup DNS backup server directory services file and storage I am selecting as per my requirement ok now done after that go to inst installation destination select here and uh, select the disk here 15.36 GB storage I am using here other storage options 
partitioning automatically if you select here automatically configuration partition server automatically configure your server as per automatically configurations and installation proceed but if you want to customize the disk you can select here i will configure partitioning and you can set the uh, partitioning select here and uh, click here done to proceed and select here partition scheme lvm jo, lvm means local volume manager you can select here lo local volume manager or standard partition i am selecting local volume manager it is manage the volumes so that i am selecting the lvm okay plus for mount partitioning setting select here the mount point select here the root partition type here the capacity of your root partition and giving 11 gb disk space for root partition add point ok select type here level i am giving root level for this partition update setting ok now click again for plus and select here the boot partition desired capacity give here the uh, capacity 500 mb for booting in windows you can see system already generated a boot partition in windows os but in linux i have we have give give desired port capacity add one point okay now set again click here the plus sign and uh, drag drop and select here the swap partition swap partition is a uh, like you can you know in windows virtual ram in linux installation uh, we have required to give the swap partition size it is twice of your physical ram in my system 4 gb ram so i am giving here 8 gb of swap partition thousand mb at point one point okay now all setting is done i am going to proceed installation so that select here the root directory and click here done now accept all settings and go to bing installation click here to bing installation for installation proceed now you can see here the user setting root password is not set select here root password and set here the root password for your linux server click here done user creation you can create user for your linux server username admin you can see here the full name administrator type here the password password and user creation is set now installation is running it is it will be take some times so i will be i will i am so i am pausing this video Okay friends, now our RHL server installation is 
has been completed now message prompt have reboot we have to reboot the server okay now linux is installed you are here you can see the version of the linux it is booting linux information localization Se select here the linux information and uh, accept the license agreement and done now finish the configuration of the server now server is booting select the kd kdom forward subscription manager registration no i prefer to register finish now our server is booting here you can see the administrator user but we have go to our root user for login select here not listed type here the root username enter and type here the root password now we are logging in our server next and finish okay friends now our RHL server installation is completed you can see here the server RHL server here you can see the applications internet sound videos system tools here you can find the setting go to setting go to network select here the wide add profile and select go to the ipv4 route here you can configure ip address for your server type here subnet mask type here gateway and configure your ip address for this linux server okay friends now you can see here the places home directory download documents downloads pictures videos computers you can see here some windows features uh, in your linux latest versions for gra because of this is the graphical gui mode server so you can user friendly Okay friends, in this video tutorial, I will guide you how to install the Linux RHL 7. If you like this video, please like, comment, share and subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching this video.